Hey buddies, what's up? Welcome to a new video on my channel. Today we're gonna finish the interior. Um, so the steering wheel has to go. And we're gonna get a nice steering wheel with a quick release in here. I also, I'm not happy with this setup. So I'm gonna rebuild that setup and make some side panels too. Um, because from the seat position I can barely reach the buttons. So I'm gonna move everything a little bit closer here. I'll probably make like a plate here and mount everything in there. And um, <clears throat> I also um, rebuild another gas pedal because this gas pedal I don't like it anymore. Uh, I drove around a little bit here and um, yeah, it's not doing the job like I wanted to. But yeah, so we're doing this seat consoles. I'm gonna have to build a rail for the left side, and then the seat consoles are done, and the uh, seat belts have to go in there too. Okay, so here I got my paperwork how to set up the seat belts, and I basically measured everything. And then, ah, oh, give me the big belt. Okay. So, like I said, that's the harness bar. We're gonna break the brackets on to hook it up right here. Right, especially if you are like there. Plus, you have to do them over an X, like this. And uh, yeah, in the front. I used basically an original point on the side there where the old seat belt was in there and uh, I have to figure out something over there what I have to do there when the seat is out probably weld a bracket there too on the other side it's a little bit easier because uh, the seat rail is off a little bit because that uh, seat is m uh, way more over to the outside I can hook it up to one of the big seat bolts at the bottom so that's gonna be fine uh, well, yeah, that's what I'm working on right now. So I put a new switch setup in here because the other switch up was too far away, so I can couldn't reach it properly from my seat position. So I put that setup in there, and then I'm working. So this is my new gas pedal solution. This video is probably more about the gas pedal than anything else because I put that in there. I welded the bracket right there, so I know I have that problem. Oh, I hit a little dent into the floor right there, so where I can lose my fit, food, feet. So it's basically like brake, right? Getting on the gas, brake, gas, and the feet is in the same position. Well, it's pretty nice. The gas pedal feels way better than the shit I built before. But then I was playing around here, and I found another issue. Like if I sit straight like this. And I go over here, okay, I have red work boots on right now, but I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna hit the the bracket. Yeah, or if I don't hit it and I can't go back, I can latch on there, but well, it's also not really good. So, well, so I'm gonna have to work on that again. And then we have to work on a hook up to the front because everything has changed there too. Two. And I still don't have a windshield in here uh, because I'm still working on the roll cage. <sighs> yep, a lot of work to do. Okay, I'm gonna relocate that bracket. I probably just cut it off and build something else. Let me come up with something and we're gonna see this again. Okay, I think I, I solved the solution down there. I basically just hammered the shit out of it. See how it is slightly bent up and down up and down, forwards and down. So now it's a little bit closer to the gas pedal and more forwards. So, um, oh, and I increased the dent down there. I don't know if you can see it, but here's like a little round dent. So I can put my feet in there like this. And then I have the gas here. Uh, then I have the brake here. I still have like half an inch to an inch to the bracket with my feet. Like I said, that are the work boots. The racing boots are way smaller. Because it doesn't have the steel toes and stuff like that. So now I can paint that. Everything good down here. Um, let's take a look at the situation at the throttle. Okay. So that's the strut tower brace. And I'm gonna weld the bracket on there. Basically, you can 
screw that on and off, break it down here, and go on there, just like this. Adjusted it everything. So now the pedal should feel better. a little heavy and the angle is not right let me see if I can change some stuff a little bit so now it's responding now it's responding really really good I like that it was a little stiff first but I installed a spring I hooked it up to the rail here um but yeah that's pretty good so that spring helps it a little bit and um yeah, that's the final setting. Alright, I think that's it for the video for today. We're gonna see us next time. Okay.